sticking with that case study, the BP Deepwater Horizon case study, um, just want to quickly dip into the S of facts. The S of facts is systems thinking. And if you think of that Deepwater Horizon disaster, uh, very quickly you start to see a whole web of stakeholders that were involved in that situation, ranging from Tony Hayward, the CEO, the staff on the oil rig, the families of the 11 men who died, the local marine industry that was devastated, the insurance companies that paid out record payment, and other organizational partners like Halliburton and Transocean. A hugely complex web of different stakeholders, different objectives. And I'm sure you have a similar challenge in the work that you do in the NHS. A huge web of stakeholders, GPs, strategic health authorities, primary care trusts, arms length bod bodies, clinicians, patients. You know that world much better than I do, but I know it sufficiently well to know that it's very complex and there are massive variety and diversity of, of stakeholders in that situation. And as a coach, I think, in, indeed for anyone, that let alone a coach in that environment, it's very easy to feel disempowered, to feel overwhelmed, to feel hopeless. You know, how can one person influence such a complex web? This is where I think the discipline of systems thinking has a huge amount to offer the coaching uh, profession and the coaching world. Uh, there are a lot of different concepts in systems thinking, um, but essentially it's based on the, on the underlying uh, belief that everything is connected to everything else, and, then th and therefore there is ability to throw a, a stone into a, a pond and create ripples, the ability for small impacts to have a huge knock-on effect on the wider organization. One of the more common uh, systems thinking terms is the butterfly effect. Some of you will have come across the butterfly effect, and this video gives you a, a, a brief sort of example of how something as small as a, a butterfly can have a, a huge impact on a complex system. <laughs> Fast. Be ready with Nationwide. So if a butterfly can do that by flapping its wings, the challenge, I think, for coaches is what can we do with the flapping of our coaching wings? Can we have that mindset that we could make a massive difference on this huge, complex system? I think if we can get in that mindset and really believe that, A, it makes it a really exciting role to play, but B, it also brings with it a responsibility a responsibility that maybe you could have that impact and maybe you are playing a bigger role than at times you really think that you are.